In this video, I will show you the use of multiple tracks in Audacity. I will show four use cases of multi-tracks. 1. How to make multi-tracks from a single track. 2. How to record in multiple tracks. 3. How to open existing files in separate tracks. And the fourth and last one will be, how to make a single track from multiple tracks. Please continue the rest of this video on full screen, so you can clearly see what I am doing. Normally a lot of screens to cover in this type of video, so a full screen generally helps. Let's first start with how to make multiple tracks from a single track. You are now seeing a single track on the screen. To make another track from this, you have to select that part first. After selecting, go to Edit, Clip Boundaries. Here you see the option for Split and Split New. Split New will take the selected part and will make another track. You can see a new track has been created below, and this new track starts from the split point. There are several ways to set the starting point of the new track. Keep the cursor on the new track by clicking on it and then go to Tracks, Align Tracks. Here you can see several options to set the starting point. Start to zero will take the starting point to the beginning. Sometimes you may need to start the track from a different point. To do that, click inside the track where you want to start. For example, I want to set starting point here. Then go to Tracks, Align Tracks again. Click on the option, Start to Cursor slash Selection Start. You see the starting point of the track has been moved. Another way to adjust the track is to use the Time Shift tool. The Time Shift tool is in the toolbar. Select it, and you can drag and drop the track to your desired point. Notice one thing, when I made a separate track an empty space is created here. If you do not want this space, just select and delete it, and it will be gone. You see a bold vertical black line appears here. It is just an indicator line, and if you click on it, it will be gone. This way you can make as many new tracks as you want. You can edit each one of these tracks separately and export them separately. Also, you can combine them into one track, which we will see later in this video. Now we will see how to record in multiple tracks. Let me cross out these existing tracks. When there is no track, the recording will start a new track and audio will be added there. If I stop recording and start recording again, it will start from where I left. So it continues recording on the same track. To record in another track, you have to add another track here first. You can do that from Tracks, Add New. There are several types of tracks here, and you have to choose either a mono or stereo track for audio recording. I will choose mono as that works fine for voice recording. A new track is created now, and you can start recording here. When a new track is created, the focus is automatically there. But to be sure you can click on it, and then start recording. Now recording started on the new track. You can add multiple tracks in this way and start recording there. Once you are done, you can export each track as a separate audio file. It is a good idea to give each track a separate name. You can easily identify between tracks as they got different names. To export tracks go to File, Export. Here select Export Multiple, and you will get separate files for each track. You can choose where to save files and which format they will be. I will choose WAV. Then you can add metadata for each track if you want. Lastly, it will show an export successful message and where the files are. So far we have seen multi-tracks from a single track and during recordings. Now we will see how to open existing files in multi-tracks. I will cross out these tracks to get a cleaner interface. I will open an existing file. We got a single track from that file, let's open another file. 
This time this file opens another single track in another Audacity window. I can switch between other Audacity windows using the keyboard shortcut command tilde in Mac. This is sample 1 windows, the first opened file. This is the window before that. And this is the last opened file. If I drag down this window other Audacity windows will be visible. To open multiple files as multiple tracks you have to use the import option. I will cross out extra Audacity windows and will keep only one. You can use the file open option for the first file. For other files, use the import option. You can import several types of files, but we are interested only in audio files now. You see two files are opened in two separate tracks using the import option. We are on the last topic in this video of multiple tracks, combining multiple tracks into a single track. I will make a cool voice effect quickly, a thinking voice effect. I have a detailed video on it, please check the I button in the top right corner of the screen. Here, I have two tracks and the whole effect is only available when both the tracks are played at the same time. Let's hear it a bit. I will, I will make, make this, this voice, voice a thought, thought voice, voice and, and easy. Okay, so you heard the effect and we need both the tracks playing at the same time. If we export, it will create separate files and the effect will be lost. The solution is to combine these two tracks. To do that, select all the tracks by Command A or Control A, then go to Tracks, Mix. I will choose Mix and Render to new track and a separate track will be created. You see a new track named Mix is created, and let's play it a bit. I will disable all other tracks. I will, I will make, make this, this voice, voice a thought, thought voice, voice and, and easy. So the effect is now combined in a single track. We can export it now. If you would like to learn about cool effects in Audacity, you can check out the playlist on the screen. Also please consider subscribing to the channel, that will make my effort worthy. Please let me know in the comment which video you would like to get next. Thank you for watching this video and see you next time. Till then take care.